Hello, welcome to an e-demo on the Clip Builder feature of Victor Unified Client. The Clip Builder allows you to make edits to video clips. You can then use the edited clip to either add to an incident or for save or export. OK, so first of all then, I'm going to open up the Clip Builder. And to do that, I'm going to choose the Home tab, then I'm going to choose Clips and Clip Builder. Once I have the Clip Builder open, I need to start to add video clips to it. And to do that, I can either drag and drop them from the incident list, or, as I'm going to do now, drag and drop them from the clips list. And once that video has come across then, I can use this red playhead just to navigate the video. OK, so if I wanted to make edits to a section of video, First of all, I need to select the section, and to do that, the first thing to do is put the red playhead where you want the section to start, and choose the marker at the top of it, and you can see that places an indicator at the bottom of the playhead there. Next, I need to just move my playhead to where I want my section to end, and again, I'm going to choose the marker, and you can see we now have a portion of the video selected and highlighted there in blue. Once I've selected a piece of video, I can make some edits to it using this toolbar. So I can do things like crop, and that's going to remove all of the video except for our selected section. And I can always use this undo button here just to step back. If I select another portion of the video, I could cut it. And what that's going to do is cut the section which I've selected out and keep the rest of the video there. I can also split the clip into various pieces by moving my playhead to where I want the split to be and choosing the split button. And once I have the split made, each of the pieces can be selected individually just by clicking them and you can see there they highlight in yellow. Once I have a piece of video selected, I can actually remove it from the clip altogether by choosing the trash can icon. The Clip Builder can be used to edit multiple clips at once, and I can just keep dragging and dropping other clips into the Builder, again, either from the Incident List or from the Clip List. And once I have all my edits made, I have two options which can be accessed by selecting the Save button on the toolbar. You can see if I choose it there, I have Build and I have Direct Action under there. If I choose to build the clip, that's going to combine all of the edits and stitch everything together into one clip. And you can see, if I select that there, the area highlights yellow to indicate the progress, and then we're going to get the clip built message indicating that it is completed. Once that's done, I can drag and drop the clip into an incident, or I can drag it into a folder in my clips list like so. If I go back across to my Save button, and I choose Direct Action, you'll see that opens up the Direct Clip Action dialog box, and from there I can save, I can save to an incident, or I can export. 